They're cheaters. This is single commentary. I mean, you can talk. All right. And here, we have Rain and LC. But it's actually Hunter. Alright, now in that situation, he should have touched us. Who won 3 0? I don't really have much to say about this because Marth Fox is kind of whack. Look at that. He just F smashes him and he can't get back. That's depressing. Say the hard R on commentary. Queso said the hard. Queso threatened to say the hard R in commentary on um, Salty Key. Queso is in Sarasota again, dude. Queso. I'm sorry, dude. First game goes to Rain. Yes. It says best of five. Just turn on the tournament mode. Off. Sketter or die. All right. It's the, um, the Alex Jones in the room. It's Hunter. That's who we're talking about here. Isn't it like a button on the, the D-pad? You have to do it. Oh, 
Just hold X and A to reset. Just hold X and A to reset. Stream, I'm sorry for the technical difficulties. We have monkeys running the stream. DJoy, Bunter, and Nicholas DeJoy are struggling to turn off input display. Well, I feel more because we're at his DMT, and I feel honored to spit on a mic. We are actually government. I'm kidding, but we are actually co cooking DMT. I don't think you even cook DMT. I think you prepare it. I wouldn't know because, again, I don't do drugs. As he flicks the stick to verse mode into melee. Raid versus Bunter. In the best of three, there are no bans. As he chooses random because he knows how to play this game. He's playing Fox. The uncertainty. He counterpicks on the FD as they spawn into the platform. As Hunter desperately tries to up tilt out of some odd reason. I think that he was trying to up there. I have no idea. The usage of up throw up tilt is inefficient in every possible matchup except like Marth and Falcon. Fox does heavily benefit off fast falling, so I have no idea why that happened. I'm on I'm on commentary. Who's in the chat? Oh let's go quad eh? What's up dude? As Raid does a dis wow, wow Bill. A wow Bill as you see, Rage has a disrespectful shine. And he's just camping ledge and missing up ledge dashes because he has carpal tunnel and that's kinda sad. And now he's just kinda BMing Hunter and he just wants to throw out short hop of his and into a double up air. He misses the triple because he was Hunter was ready for the side B. And Raid inefficiently, inefficiently making combos, nearing instead of reverse back airing, because he does not play Fox. A missed edge guard, which might turn into a working edge guard. No, he is still struggling to edge guard Hunter. Within this situation, I think Hunter needs to get some chain grabs. He needs to do something to um, prevent him from getting bodied. This is a good grab. He needs to not up air in the situation where he's behind him and he wouldn't have enough drift to get into him. Hunter just holding in and letting Rage shine spike him. This is called the um, I can't kill with Marth syndrome. He's just struggling to get something that works and he needs to not get stuck in shield and start moving. To the back here, this should be it. There it is, Raid with a schmack across the stage. As Hunter nods his head in approval. That's not it. Hey Bill, how's the stream for you? I've got someone watching. Ready? Go! Alright. Not into the next FD counter pick. That doesn't really make sense. Maybe he's just trying to jank him out because Raid doesn't have very much movement with Fox. But then again, I think Hunter's just playing the game. Alright. Opting for a forward air tipper, which would have made it if he reacted to the tech, but up air is a lot more guaranteed and probably has more options. Really good nair and neutral, but nothing to capitalize on. He just kind of let him backstage on for free. All right, let's see a side B onto a pretty decent mix of mid raid miss. All right, into the miss there. Can he do it again? Oh, if he got a, if he get up attack there, I thought he would have the biggest brain in SRQ. <laughs> Alright, that was really good. I think this counter pick's working out because Raid just isn't moving as well as he was on FD and Battlefield. The platform's really mess up, you know, wanting to jump and changing jump. Okay. Throwing 
have some good fares. Hunter getting called out with a spot dodge. It's okay, he only took 25%. There's not a good damage. Well, he baited out a free spot dodge into an S smash. What I don't understand is why didn't he just jump out the way as soon as he ran out of the way? I think wave dash forward is a bit fraudulent with Marth, but it just works for the best of us. Alright. If he has a jump here, I think he, yeah, he has a jump. He's gonna make it back. Oh! Okay. <laughs> Thank you for coming to the stream, Adderall. I appreciate the subway game. Are you in relation with the plant game because you use uh, vegetables to make sandwiches? Here you're watching um, Hunter striving um, to make this game happen. He's getting up here right now, but I think he can make it back. Good fair call out, keep him away. Missing the side B punish. <laughs> the sandwich lords, oh my goodness. If Raid went in a little bit more forward with the air under the left platform, he would have shield poke and had the freest punish of his life, but he just missed space in just a tad. Alright, Raid's just kind of moving. I don't think he cares what move he's going to use, he just wants something into dash attack up smash. Alright, it does not punish the miss tech, but he's going to punish this. No, he doesn't go out there. Or he goes out there, but he goes the wrong way. And he just dies. As Expansion Esports negates their sponsorship of having a Nintendo sponsorship by showing they have a 20XX copy. Hunter's just showing the I play ultimate um, mentality right now and not reacting to edge guards, not jumping up there, not reacting to side Bs. He needs to do something to edge guards to give us his game. Pretty good power shield. I don't understand why he's not dead, and now he's dead. I think Hunter needs to cheese him to win this, but I don't think he wants to cheese him. Side Bs, please? No. If he maybe. Oh. 